Hold on, hold on. Before we get into this video, this is just an updated version of the tutorial I made in 2020. Everything about this modifying process is still the same, so if you have any troubles with this video, make sure to check the first one. Let's begin, shall we? First, go to your internet browser, look up Smappy, and click on smappy.io, which should be the first link on your screen. It'll guide you to a website that looks like this. From here, hover over Download Smappy and whatever the most recent version is, and click on Direct Download. Once downloaded, go to the corner of your screen and hit Open. When you click on the folder, in the folder, you'll be given an option for what operating system you want to install it on. I use Windows, so I would click on the... Oh right, I need to extract it. Anyway, for this tutorial, I'm using Windows. When I click on the Windows installation file, it'll take me to a screen. If I press 1, I can install Smappy to my Stardew Valley. This is what you want, so press 1 and hit enter. It'll ask you another question, install or uninstall. Click 1 again if you want to install it, and if you want to uninstall it, then why did you click on this video? Now that you downloaded Smappy, search Nexus Mods and click on the first link. In order to download mods for free, create an account for Nexus. Once you have created an account, find a Stardew Valley mod that fits your needs and click on Manual. It will remind you that Smappy is required for the mod. That's alright, because we already downloaded it. If you do not want to pay for the download, I recommend doing the slow download. It only takes 5 seconds. As this mod is currently downloading, I'm going to show you how to find Stardew Valley in your files. First, go to the Stardew Valley page in your Steam library. Then click on the gear off to the right. Hover over Manage, Browse Local Files, and go into your Mods folder. Now that you know where your Stardew Valley mod folder is, you can extract your newly downloaded mod into your Stardew Valley folder. This is quite simple. Go to your Stardew Valley folder and scroll until you find the Smappy application. Once you've found it, just create a shortcut, rename it to whatever you want, and it fits perfectly with your other games. 